Hello, everyone, and Happy New Year. I want to take a moment to reflect on the tremendous 40th anniversary year we celebrated as an organization in 2023. And to tell you how grateful we are for all of you. You are the heart and soul of our organization. You know, it's been quite moving to reflect on our early days as an organization when a few determined families came together to fill the gaps and resources in hydrocephalus. We are forever grateful for our founding families and their vision and fortitude. We hosted an amazing 40th anniversary gala celebration in Anaheim, California in November, bringing together our community and commemorating four decades of impact, dedication, and support for our community. We honored HA's founders, the Fudges and the Marks, and we were also able to posthumously honor Cynthia Solomon's strategic impact in the area of research by renaming our residence prize to the Hydrocephalus Association Cynthia Solomon Residence Prize. We continue to be proud of the success of research supported by HA. We now host an annual research workshop which brings together existing and new scientists through the generous sponsorship of the Rudy Schulte Research Institute. Our most recent workshop focus was developing non-invasive hydrocephalus therapies. Our Innovator Awards are a testament to the spirit of innovation within the scientific and medical communities. This past year, we were able to fund seven Innovator Awards collectively with the support of Team Hydro and the Rudy Schulte Research Institute. We have funded 62 grants to cutting edge scientists since our research program inception, as well as our continued support of three research networks. Our total investment is $14 million and those scientists and networks have gone on to secure follow-on funding totaling $74 million for an infusion of $88 million in hydrocephalus research. And this research is providing an elevated impact. For example, a recent milestone is the ongoing first ever human clinical trial testing a drug combination to prevent hydrocephalus after a brain bleed. This groundbreaking development in non-invasive therapies for hydrocephalus is a testament to progress, a reality we couldn't have fathomed even two decades ago. Special thanks to Johns Hopkins scientists, Dr. Shenandoah Robinson and Dr. Lauren Jancy for blazing the trail towards non-invasive hydrocephalus treatment. In September, Hydrocephalus Awareness Month brought a new profound impact as the world came together to observe the inaugural World Hydrocephalus Day, a day dedicated to raising global awareness about hydrocephalus and showing support for individuals living with this complex neurological condition. Our team continues to be committed to providing up-to-date, trusted information to meet the needs of our community. We continuously enhance our website content to provide the most current news and research. And in 2023, we released a new video about hydrocephalus where people can learn about the condition, treatment methods, and how to spot signs and symptoms of complications. We are also thrilled that we were able to award 13 scholarships to impressive young people pursuing college degrees. We couldn't accomplish this success without amazing volunteers who support our mission through direct service to our community, fundraising, and strategic oversight. Well, it was another spectacular year for HA Walks, raising almost $1.8 million. 40 walks were held across the U.S. with more than 7,000 participants and over 800 teams. Our walk leaders are revered at HA and we cannot express our appreciation enough for their labor of love. Our app, Hydro Assist, has changed countless lives by enabling our community members to capture their entire treatment history on their cell phones. In February, get ready, the app will be completely new, so be ready for improved functionality. 
HA continues to advocate on Capitol Hill for legislation and research funding impacting the hydrocephalus community. We are excited to announce that six new members of Congress have joined the Pediatric and Adult Hydrocephalus Caucus to represent the families in their districts living with hydrocephalus. The caucus currently consists of 19 members and we are looking to bolster these numbers as we meet with more offices going into 2024. We are looking forward to an exciting 2024 with so much in store, including AJ Connect, our in-person 18th National Conference on Hydrocephalus to be held in Tampa, Florida, July 25th through the 27th. Registration will be opening in February and you can stay updated on the latest information at hydrocephalusconference.org. You won't wanna miss this incredible experience. On behalf of all of us at HA, we thank you for your continued support and hope your 2024 is filled with success and happiness.